I love you kids. I hope you all have fun carving pumpkins tonight. Be looking for your vlog so I can watch it. And remember, I love you and I'll see you very soon. You guys are just gonna have to bear with me for a while. I'm saving up for a new camera. I don't have one yet. I'm making do with what I have. And I don't really know exactly. Like I'm not quite comfortable yet vlogging and I have to get better at talking to you guys directly, so I'm definitely working on doing that. So just, yeah, bear with me for now. Right? Yes, so we will. The kids are gonna be sad when they find out Dad's gone, especially when they get off the bus. So if you guys like these family vlogs or whatever, please make sure you thumbs them up and subscribe to the channel if you guys wanna see more of our daily life, our daily vlogs, um, and I will work on doing them. Right now, it's just gonna basically be while Garen's gone that we upload vlogs, but if y'all are liking them, then I will just upload them daily instead of just when Garen's gone, if you want me to. So, like them, if you like them. Well, just like them, please. And just keep watching for new videos, and hopefully I, you guys heard me because I just realized I was covering how to get my vlogger arm so my videos aren't so shaky. I'm not quite used to that yet, so we'll get it figured out. I love you kids. Have a great day. I'll see you tomorrow. I love you. Have a great day. Just one more. Okay. Love you. Love you. Have Bye. a great day. Bye. Love you. See you later. Bye. Yeah. See you. Bye. That's how we do that. He says our goodbyes. And Karen and I are the type of couple that I gotta put my seatbelt on before drive. Got a million people staring at me wondering what the hell I'm doing. Excuse my language. That's one thing I gotta get used to at this whole vlogging experience is Karen and I are the type of couple that we do everything together. We go grocery shopping together. We go to the doctor together. We go to the dentist together. Like, we seriously are each other's best friends, and we have been for 13 years, and so being away from each other for us is not easy because we truly enjoy each other's company. I'm going to upload a sugar cookie recipe to my other channel today, so you guys are going to have to go check that out, see what you think. But I'm getting on the road now, so i got to go. You're just singing. If you don't, I don't care. I'll pull down your underwear. <laughs> Get it because candy's unhealthy. Oh. Well, the kids just got home. Um, forgot it was early out day again. It's a great thing they read the bus. Because I, in Texas, we didn't have early out day. So, even though it's October and they've been at school for November, August, September, and now October, I still forget that every Monday is early out day. One day, I'll figure this out. Say hi. Hey, I weighed 47 pounds. <laughs> you did? Did you just weigh yourself on the scale? Yes. Hey, wait, come here. I gotta tell you guys something. What? Hey, so now I'm gonna tell them. Go stand over there so I can tell y'all. Your dad got called out on a train. How? He won't be back till tomorrow night sometime. How many times are you gonna say, I want my daddy. You're not my daddy. But you know you tell me? to tell you to make sure that we carve pumpkins and to record it so he can watch you guys carving your pumpkins. I'm gonna try to carve my pumpkin by myself this year. Okay, how are you gonna carve your pumpkin? I'm gonna put a sack base on it and I'm gonna try and make my own uh, little pumpkin on, a pumpkin carved on the top as a sun. You excited? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so as soon as Dylan gets home, we're gonna carve pumpkins. And then either tonight or tomorrow we're going to make cookies and we're going to frost them and decorate them and eat them. And it's going to be fun. Dad said, a, Dad said as soon as we got home. I know, but you got to wait for your brother. He'll be home in like 40 minutes, right? Mm -hmm. So you're excited? What are you eating? Kit Kat. Where'd you get it from? Grandma. Grandma, did she come see you yesterday? Okay. Hey, that's mine! So we're gonna 
we're going to hurry and get homework done. Raya got two of them. She got two Kit Kat packs. You got a Kit Kat pack and a York peppermint patty. And so did Dilly got a Kit Kat pack and good and plenties. Oh, he did. Okay, so we're going to wait for Dilly to get home and we're going to carve some pumpkins and I'm going to feed these guys and we're going to do some homework. Huh? You want to say hi to Dad? You don't really care with how much sugar. Dad doesn't really care if you say no and we don't tell, tell him you say no for to do something, but he said yes. So you're the parent that doesn't care about sugar. And Dad's the parent that let us lets us get off the hook. So you're the best parents in the world. <laughs> Pick up your drop of ice cream, goof nut. Don't go eat it. <laughs> well, <laughs> to my life, I guess kids they they think I let them eat sugar, and they. Grady's first time when he said it, he said that Garen is the more less responsible parent because the kids get away with more with him. And I had to catch that on camera because I thought you would love it, Garen. Huh? Yeah! What are you doing? Cook me a bowl of ice cream. Man, these talks are good! Gosh! We're just having a snack, gonna do homework. Having some tots. Having some tots. From Tater Tot Land. Comes from Tater Tot. Um, we're gonna wait for Bill to get home and we're gonna carve up this. And I'm writing my blog today. So you guys are gonna have to go check it out. So I'm just trying to get it all done. It's on faith. So go to my website, which is Jamie Stimson, J-A-M-I-E Stimson S-T-I-M-P-S-O-N dot org. And read my blog. Hey, love your butts. Bye. What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> little bit crazy. I get a lot of ice cream. Oh, mm. Do you think that's going to feed your cough? Do you think it's going to make you more phlegmy? That's mom's homemade syrup in there. And it's way better, huh? So I'm writing my Stimson family blog right now, so you guys are going to have to go check it out. Oh, yeah. What the heck? You want to show everybody your new kicks? Your new kicks? Aren't they cute with the cheetah and the hot pink? Huh. Oh, remember my friend? She has the same shoes as me. Oh my gosh, she does? Mm -hmm. That's so cool. Do you like that? Mm -hmm. Wanna show dad how loose your tooth is? Oh, that baby's coming out. Come here. <laughs> Let's take it out. Come on. Let's see ya. Let's see ya. I'm gonna pull it out. <laughs> I'm gonna pull it out. Let's no. pull out your tooth. Come no. on. Let me. <laughs> I can do the crane kick. What's the crane kick? Yeah. <laughs> Good job. Is there somebody out here that wants to come inside? Do you come inside? Huh? Come on. Are you coming in? The one that I eat. Noonie? Come on. You're just going to scratch at the door as soon as I shut it again. Shut the door, Grade. Dad, do a video. Mom, do a video of me eating this. See, I told you. Now come inside. Come on. Good boy. Are you guys' children as crazy as mine? Huh? Yes, she is always this loud. Yes, she is. And yes, we love her for it. We accidentally made your hole too small, so it's kind of hard to get in there and get the pumpkin guts out, huh? So then this is Graydon's pumpkin. We're hoping that it's not a solid wall in there. We're hoping that it's like open inside. So we're gonna just cut in there. I've already started to see if we can see what it looks like inside. So as soon as we get there, we'll show you. 
We just need to set the camera up and just like kind of. Well, I. The, the pumpkin bested the knife. This pumpkin knife. <laughs> Completely off. In the pumpkin. See, it's right there. That pumpkin's a beast. <laughs> so I guess we're gonna find a knife here in a minute. Isn't that exciting? So, but we have it cut oh, round. I was just finishing those last little cuts right there on the side. Dylan's starting to cut his right now. Look how many guts I have. And Raya's got hers cleaning out. So as soon as I can open it, I will let you guys know what it looks like inside. So we were able to completely cut Grady's pumpkin, um, the top out very well because it was walled all the way up. I'll show you guys now what I'm talking about. See, it kind of looks like that. We, we had to split it in two and I'm hoping I can kind of put it back together so it still looks like two pumpkins or one pumpkin. So yeah, that's where we're at. Right now we're done with the pumpkin so we're gonna go ahead and show you how you they look like, okay? See, so this is Ray or Dylan's. He tried to make the eye look like a clock. And then this is Raya's pumpkin. And then on the back of it, she has her name carved. Look on the back of Dylan's. And then this is my pumpkin that I carved and we had to separate it. And then this is Graydon's pumpkin. Huh. And yeah. the separation. I did my best. Everybody did very good, huh, Deli? There we go. And we'll stick them out on the front porch tonight. We'll light them up.